Hamilton Beach egg cooker. This thing is pretty awesome. So all you have to do is plug it in. Let's see, get it plugged in. It'll turn on, let's see. It'll say the power's on, zero, zero seconds. Once this uh, light turns green, that means it's preheated and ready to go. Um, while that's preheating, I'll open this up and kind of show you a few things. So you open that up. Looks a little complicated, but once you uh, figure out how to use this bad boy, it's super easy, super convenient. My wife and I used this for about a year while we were meal prepping uh, breakfast sandwiches. We've kind of switched up our meal prep and plan, so we haven't really been using this as much. But it has a nice non-stick surface here. It's really easy to clean. I'm going to unplug this so I don't actually burn myself. Um, really easy to clean. All this is non-stick. Um, everything kind of lifts up so that'll lift up so what we would do is we would put our english muffin down here at the bottom and then if we had any kind of meat or anything like that we would put that on top so we were doing uh, little sausage patties so we put english muffin sausage patty close these down and the great thing is you can make two sandwiches at the same time and you break your egg put every seasoning in there and then put your cheese on top of that so the cheese gets all melty um, oh no, sorry. I would put the cheese down here on top of the meat as well, or under the meat. So English muffin, cheese, sausage. So you can tell it's been a little bit. English muffin, cheese, sausage, close down, egg, uh, put all your spices on there, another English muffin, and then you close all the way down. Be careful with this. This does get hot up here, this metal surface. But once you're done, all you do is slide this open, the egg and the English muffin fall down. Then you lift this up, and then you have a sandwich right there. Do the same thing on the other side, pull that out, lift up, and you got the sandwich right there. So the cool thing also is, once you start this up, and I'll show you real quick once I close this back up, plug this back in. So say this said it was already preheated, you can set a timer here, one minute, two minute, three minute, four minute. We would typically set it between four minutes to four and a half minutes. And that's really the only buttons you have on there is setting the time. Um, once it's preheated, it's ready to go. Cooks your sandwich real well.